Experiencing negative emotions is a natural part of life. I took it back to gratitude and it was the one thing that just re-centred me. It's so natural just to try to push away something negative and being able to sit with that is actually something that takes a lot of practice actually. I was hilarious while my mic was muted. It's quite easy to want to react or to fix it for that individual but most of the time it's just that we as humans want to be heard. We're not very good at suppressing negative emotions and when we try to it actually makes them stronger. When people feel further away, which often happens in these situations, we tend to think differently. We're much more focused on sort of big ideas rather than small details. At the moment I'm focusing on how I reframe the situation to, to really draw out those positive emotions. We're not just trying to work from home, we're trying to keep our relationships alive, we're trying to keep our relationship with our children alive. Negative emotions have a place in our life. I'm gone. I'm in my negative and here you are trying to ram your positivity down my throat. Let's just call it that. We haven't even considered that, but let's just call it that. This is a quite isolating time for people. So acknowledgement first and then co-creation of solutions second. If we're doing something for another purpose and the feeling better is an incidental consequence, then the emotional benefit is much more lasting. I agreed with everything you were talking about until you said I don't actually have an answer to your question.